Hi everyone, so I know I haven't made a video in a while and I'm really sorry, um, but honestly I just haven't had too much to talk about. Um, I have nothing new going on with dolls or anything and that kind of stuff, but I was going to make a brand new video for you. Well, I, I did make a video, but it didn't work because making the video ended up defeating the purpose of the video. Um, what I mean is, I bought a bunch of makeup so I could do a zombie look. I found a tutorial on YouTube that was really cool, so I wanted to try and do that. So, when I took the video, um, the point was not to show you how I did it, but to show you what I had done. And I feel like you really couldn't see what I did because um, I had done some cool little veins on my face. and. My face was kind of like a splotchy, greenish, skin tony red color, um, and it didn't really show on camera. Um, and I had like red all in my eyes, so it looked um, irritated and, and dark. And um, I used a purple eyeshadow to make my face look dirty because that actually did a really awesome job of making uh, like it look dirty. Um, but it didn't show very well, so I was very disappointed and opted not to show that photo, uh, that footage. But I have a photo which is okay, and I'll show you guys. Um, bear in mind, this is the first time I've ever played with makeup extensively like this, and also, um, it's the first time I did it, so if it sucks, that's that's why. But I think um, it's okay. I don't think it's great, but I think it's okay for a first try. Um, and I know it doesn't really look like the YouTubers tutorial that they did, and because I, I kind of made it my own, which was nice. That way I could have my own look that wasn't so much of a copy, just as uh, learning what to use to get a similar effect. Um, so I will show you guys a photo of my zombie look. Um, other than that, though, I really don't have too much going on. Chilling with Ghosty. Um, Tomo's in the background, and as you guys know by now, um, Asenva had offered to do a face-up on Izumi for me, and just so you guys know, she looks amazing, um, and I'm really pleased with what Asenva did, and Asenva did a really great job, and she was a really great friend to suggest uh, that to me, it was just really nice of her. So, a uh, big thank you to her, and I can't wait to have Izumi back with me, and I can restring her and, and have that sorted. Um, and I'm also really excited to eventually get Rin, who is going to be my soon Mixie. Um, and the fun thing about Rin and Izumi is that they're part of the same storyline, so I'm going to be doing photo shoots with them. Um, and... I think it's going to be really fun because Rin likes to piss off Izumi, um, even though they're best friends. She likes to tease her and be a pain in the butt. So it's going to be really fun and hopefully I can bring that across in photos. Um, other than that, I've just been playing video games, honestly, or working. Um, but I've been playing uh, my DS and I've been playing Fallout New Vegas and trying to finish um what's that game called right over there i could try and find it or i could just think with this brain of mine um heavy rain Ugh. um i've been trying to finish heavy rain because ever since i let the game update with to the move compatible stuff i think i have to continue moving using um, the move controllers to play the game, which is fine, but on my small TV It doesn't really work very well because if I back up too much, I can't really see very well um, and then The controller doesn't end up working very well, but then I went downstairs to my big TV and um, I got it all working Properly, it's really great and it's really fun. So um, I'm gonna continue that probably tomorrow a little bit um Oh, and I'm also really mad about the whole Fox deal. Um, yeah, I don't give a crap about sports. But Glee is a huge deal to me, and I missed Glee tonight because of it. But that's okay, I'll watch it tomorrow, but it's still a pain in the butt. 
that uh, Cubavision isn't getting Fox right now, uh, but that's okay. So no one is allowed to ruin the Rocky Horror Picture Show episode for me of Glee, because um, I cannot wait to see it tomorrow, because um, I'll just watch it online tomorrow morning, probably on Hulu or whatever. Um, what else? That's about it, guys. Um, I don't have too much going on right now. Oh, actually, one more thing. Um, if some of you check out Inky Bear's video, she's um, another moderator for the BGDX group that I'm a moderator of. Um, she posted a video about NaNoWriMo. Um, I'm not really going to explain what that is exactly. Um, it's a writing contest, kind of, where uh, you win if you write a 175-page book, I believe or 50,000 words or something, but anyway, I tried to do it last year, that didn't work out because I was so busy with school, I was writing a thesis, that was hectic and crazy. So this year, I have decided to go for it, and um, I told my mom, and she was excited for me, so I'm really happy to go ahead and do this, and I'm going to try and write a horror novel. You never know though, it could change while I'm writing, just because the whole idea with NaNoWriMo is just right, 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 and it really doesn't matter uh, what you're churning out as long as um, you end up getting to your goal. So this is about quantity, not quality, which isn't that bad of an idea because, you know, you should go back and revisit what you've already wrote and edit, edit, edit. So I think it's a really awesome idea, and it's something I don't do because when I write, I like to make sure I have everything planned. Um, in my head anyway, I don't, I should write like a storyboard or, or ideas out or like some kind of flow chart, but I don't, um, I just write, 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 and then if I don't like something, I'll go back and delete it, and sometimes I'll read over my stuff and edit, but, um, I am going to try this new way, um, so I'm going to try a new story, um, I'm not exactly sure what it's going to be about, but, um, I believe it's going to be about a couple, um, because... In most of my other stories, I make it about a character who's single and, and meets someone. Um, so in this one, it's going to be about a couple. Um, so I hope you guys enjoy the photo, and I hope you guys uh, look forward to my NaNoWriMo and BJD stuff and the stuff I come out with, I guess. Um, oh, I've been meaning to say, if anyone has any questions, uh, honestly about anything, I'm an open book. If anyone wants to know anything about me, anyone wants to know anything about BJDs, ask me and I'll make a video. Um, doesn't hurt, just ask. I'm always up to answer people's questions. I honestly am that person who will answer your question even if it's silly and ridiculous. Believe me, I've gotten lots of silly and ridiculous questions in my day, so I do not mind. So go ahead, ask me anything you want, and I would love to answer. Otherwise, have a great night, guys. Bye.